morning, you guys. Welcome back to another vlog. My name is Brianna, if you are new here. Um, I just tried to record my morning, but it got a little bit messed up. So I literally left East Boston, came to get a coffee, got my nails done. Now I'm heading home. Um, I have to get things prepared for Palm Beach. I have to pack, do laundry, well, do laundry, then pack. Um, clean up my room, just get prepared, make a to-do list, all that stuff. So, um, I just got the Hailey Bieber chrome nails. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do we like it? I think I like it. But I also think, like, throughout, through, like, all the trouble that it took to rub this polish on, like, I think that I could just get this with, with a nail polish, if that makes any sense, but... I think I like it. I hadn't gotten my nails done in so long, as I mentioned. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go home. I'm starving, so I need to make some breakfast. There's a really big truck in the way right now. Um, I'm gonna go home, make some breakfast. I think Gabby's gonna come over at some point. Uh, we are also going to, I think, go to the Natick Mall because I am in a Boston group on Facebook and I literally just found out that the Natick, no, sorry, I found out that the Zara Newberry location has signs up that say it's closed. So I don't know, I think someone mentioned it was maybe because the AC wasn't working. And if you live in Boston, we've been in a, and if you live in Boston, and if you live in Boston, we've been in a, like four week heat wave. So I c it was already hot in that store to begin with. So I cannot imagine shopping in that store without air conditioning. But I haven't been to the Natick one since they just put in um, self checkout at the, at the Zara, which is crazy. So um, yeah, I will bring you along for the day. I'll show you what I pack. I need to like, I wanna specifically make outfits because I do not want to overpack at all. It is literally going to be 100 degrees in Palm Beach, so I really just like want to bring as little clothing as possible. I think we're probably just going to be in bathing suits for the day and then going to dinner and pajamas and that's pretty much it. So I will keep you updated on that. So sorry it's so dark in here, but um, I'm starting to pack a little bit. I'm trying the whole packing cube method. I don't know how it's gonna work in a carry-on, but I'm gonna try because when we travel and we, um, like the hotel room becomes a bomb, so I kinda wanna try to keep everything into cubes and see if that'll keep me organized. But I'm using this new uh, suitcase. It's the Cypress from Calpac. Um, I really like Calpac. I have their carry-on. Um, it's like gray. I don't know if you can see the color, but I have this carry-on that I bought from them last year, and it's the one that slides onto the back of the, the handle of the, um, carry-on, but I don't know if I want to take this one or my H&M tote because I'm also thinking that this could be like a cute beach bag to carry around. So I don't know which one I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna see if I can fit everything I need in this one because I'm probably just gonna do like makeup and toiletries in my carry-on and like my laptop and my book. So I don't know which one is gonna work, but I'm just trying to get a few things together. Um, trying my best to use the packing cubes. Trip with Jacqueline complaining. I mean, it's so like live. storage. <laughs> I'm being that girl right now. 
Oh, what is what it? Is it? <laughs> we will see you guys. Look at my brother. <laughs> What you doing? Got me up all night, feeling stupid. For wondering where you are and why we play this same game every other weekend. Hold my heart in the palm of your hand, tear it all apart. Why let you do it? This is just so typical. I'm sick of love. check in on the vlog. Say hi girls. Hi girls. We are in a major state of relaxation right now, but we're about to order lunch. It is 2.42 right now, so it's definitely like a late lunch, but we're very hungry because we haven't eaten since the airport this morning, so we're gonna get some lunch, hang out. We got chairs that are facing the ocean instead of the pool, so yeah. Oh, I know what I saw earlier. It's a crispy chicken wing. So happy to be here. <laughs> Caitlin is always talking about food. Go talk to that guy. Little appetizer before lunch. I love what's inside's even better. Cheers. <laughs> Let me tell you one thing. Coconut. If you give a girl a drink and a coconut, she's gonna take a photo of it. Oops, I'm in my own shadow. Here's my lunch. Caitlin got the salmon. Oh, it smells so good. Thank you. And Jacqueline got the tacos. I said, don't mind me, I'm checking in. I did say that. Um, what's up, guys? It's now 4.44. And we just went into the ocean. And it was like 90 degrees. Is that an exaggeration? No. It was like almost 86, 90 degrees. It was the water. <laughs> I, just, I don't know, my pool's been, my pool's been 86. Warmer than that. Warmer than your pool. I don't know, the water felt warmer than the air. And the air right now is 87. So it's gotta be warmer than 87, but anyways. It is so nice and it was very enjoyable, but the sun was too hot, so we had to get out and come back to our chairs, but this is it, we're just relaxing. This is the vibe for the trip. We just got back from the pool to these goodies and a little note <laughs> and some wine. Mm. As if we need to eat anymore. <laughs> oh, yeah. You guys, this view is literally crazy. It's so pretty. It kind of reminds me of like South Beach, but obviously we are in Palm Beach. So beautiful. I feel so lucky to be able to come on these trips. I definitely got some color. Oh my god, I'm so burnt. But yeah, we're just um it's like almost 7:30, I think, and we're just gonna go down. I think we're just gonna go to the restaurant um that's in the lobby down there and just get like bar food. We had lunch at like four o'clock, so we're not really that hungry yet. So we'll probably honestly go down there at like nine, maybe eight thirty. And eat later. But yeah, we're all showered and clean, and I will check in at dinner. <laughs> what are you thinking of the property thus far? I think I've been to a handful of Four Seasons in my career. I might rate this as at the top, Woo! Woo! but we'll see. First yeah. day, I'll let you know. Ask me on Monday. We will. We will give a recap for sure. Definitely. 
a full rate. What do I know? Not much. Going to dinner. Because all we do is eat.